Hello guys, welcome back to Denzel World. Today you will see the most beautiful wall divider designs. A room divider is a screen or piece of furniture placed in a way that divides a room into separate areas. Room dividers are used by interior designers and architects as means to divide the space into separate distinct areas. There are a number of different types of rooms dividers such as cubical partitions, pipe, drape, screens, shoji screens, and walls. Room dividers can be made from many materials including wood, fabric, plexiglass, frame cotton, canvas, plated fabric, or mirrors. Plants and shelves or railings might also be used as dividers. Portable rooms dividers have folded wall panel supported on wheels. In general, Room dividers are used in one of these ways to divide rooms creating a more efficient use of the space within the room. Second, as decorators and pieces to add characters to room space. Third, to hide areas of different usage or privacy protection. Fourth, to decorate rooms for better home design effects. They may completely obscure as in floor to ceiling dividers or may allow sight through as for example when plant pots are used to divide areas. Houses and other residents use a room divider to divide the space more effectively or as decorating focus point. There are many uses for a room divider including dividing the room, adding the privacy to any space and hiding clutter and increasing storage and access to the room. Other uses including adding color, redirecting foot traffic, recreating a foyer, adding a desk from modesty screen, creating coziness or adding a decorative background. Most commonly used in the residence is a small room divider, sometimes called a folding shoji screen. Shoji screen are usually trifold walls. A shoji screen may also be used to section off part of a bedroom or family room as an office. Plant, bookshelves, railings, fireplaces, light fixtures, and drapes have all been used to effectively create distinct spaces in individuals, apartments, and homes. In school or religious facilities, room dividers primarily are used to create temporary classrooms for education in large open rooms. Since the room were designed originally to be open for other purposes, the most common type of room divider is a portable room divider on caster which can easily be moved from place to place. After class, the room divider is rolled back into its storage area for future use. Hotels and restaurants use two different types of room dividers. Commonly, you will see floor to ceiling room dividers in banquet halls and meeting spaces. This fixed divider can be used to divide a banquet room into smaller facilities. In areas where room dividers need more flexibility, hotels, restaurants might use portable partitions, similarly to those used in schools. In offices, room dividers are typically more permanent in nature and attach directly to the floor. These office cubicles room dividers allow taking a large office space and breaking it into quieter and more focused subdivided offices. There are so many ways to decorate our interior design. However, not all people have the same chance to decor the home with limitless areas because the room is not too big to experiment. Therefore, they tend to find a way that is helpful juggling the narrow space completed with good room distribution. Spending more materials and budget to shift the concrete wall is not always good for a small house. Sometimes room dividers become the best alternative for aesthetic need without decreasing the space. Adapting the style from an oriental country, Japan, a room looks good with sliding frosted divider for light and space saver choice. Yes, it is cheaper than concrete wall, but the result is just the same, even better. 
using bookshelves to be a room divider is a new style to exhibit your hobby in the in traffic of the house it saves your budget but it is also creative to to defer your retreat with others meanwhile for shabby check interior design it will be nice to bring paper curtain design shape in white round yes it is practical and you are even able to make it yourself at home sometimes setting up a counter is an innovative and useful way of partitioning a space this is especially helpful if you are looking for ways to split a kitchen and a dining room consider installing a kitchen island which can double up as a breakfast counter and a soft barrier the best thing about this option is that it still maintains the openness of your space without hindering the view last but not least you can always go for stylish blinds to effectively mask the view blinds take up little space and are super easy to assemble and move around they add a sophisticated look to your room blinds create a division without fully enclosing the space and thus maintain a breeze feel thank you for watching this video